What's going on guys? It is X Shiny Ninja here and we're just going to bring you a quick video on how you would make a showdown set and implement that into the Discord. So I know a lot of people have been asking me how do I use SysBot? How do I make a set? How is Discord the same as Twitch chat? Because I do allow people to make custom created Pokemon in my Twitch chat guys if you have not you know, ever been to a stream, definitely check us out. We are a growing community. We care about the community and it's definitely chill vibes all the time. So check us out on Twitch guys at X Shiny Ninja. You know, I'm on YouTube as well. We're gonna start doing some YouTube videos. You know, this one's gonna be a little short and sweet to the point video about how to make the showdown set uh, and a couple other things you can do in Discord. So we're gonna jump right into it by showing you how to create the set. So all the links of all of the websites that we are going to be using today are going to be in the description so make sure to use when needed all right so the first website you guys are going to go to is uh, uh pokemon showdown you know so you know it's either you can make the set and then join my discord but guys you have to be in the discord to do this so uh you know i will leave my link to the discord as well i will give everybody that joins the ninja role so you are able to, uh, you know, use the, you know, we have three bots. We have Articuno, Arceus, and we have Ninja Bot. So those are the three free ones, and we have one for our Twitch subscribers. So, you know, so four bots total. So we're gonna jump into it, guys. Uh, you know, so what you're gonna want to do first is once you get to the website, is hit New Team. After you hit New Team, you're gonna go to Add Pokemon. So, you guys can see there's a list of all the Pokemon that you guys can uh, use. So you're able to, you know, custom create any Pokemon that's tradable in Sword and Shield. So you guys know, like, you know, Crown Zation, Crown Zamazenta, like Fuse Pokemon, G-Max, Melmetal, Shiny, you know, the Shiny Lockmons, Fuse, stuff like that, guys, that's not tradable in the game, you cannot create. But everything that is legally tradable can be traded, guys, through the SysBot. So... What we're going to start off with is getting an example Pokemon. So an example of something, like I guess we could use Tyranitar. So type in Tyranitar. You can see as, uh, you know, more letters you type, the, you know, the more uh, possibilities pop up. So there is our T-Tar. So uh, we're going to pick, you know, after you go and pick your Pokemon, you pick the item you want it to hold. As you can see, there's another list of all the items, and you could put literally anything you want on there. Um, so after you decide on your item, you know, I'm just going to go with Master Ball just for the example. You know, we want Master Ball on there. You guys can pick any ability that the Pokemon has that's obviously legal. Like there's some abilities out there that you can't have. Like you can't have an authentic Shiny Sinistee with its hidden ability. There's just, if you guys know, there is some that you can't use. But most of them, like 90% is, is good. So I'm going to give it its hidden ability. And guys, before you hit the moves, make sure to go to details. Shiny, yes, of course. Uh, male, female, make it whatever level, as long as uh, it can be that level as a T-Tar. So obviously it can't be level one. It's not legal, it won't trade. Uh, so after you pick all of that, make sure to go to moves and give it four legal moves, guys. I'm just gonna pick any four, you know, just because, you know, it doesn't really matter. This is just for an example, but you have to make sure that these moves are legal for a T-Tar or the Pokemon you're choosing. You know, and you can give it a nickname, whatever you guys would like. You know, Ninja, shout out to the Ninja fam. Um, you know, so after that, you're gonna wanna hit the stats box. So here we are, the stats. You know, so if you are just a beginner and you guys don't really care much about the EVs, IVs, nature, stuff like that, you can just hit guest spread and it will give it the best uh, spread possible for the moves and everything you've chose already. So, you know, we, you know, you can hit that if you'd like. It gives it 252 attack, 252 HP, and four special defense. Uh, you know, but you can mess with these dials and literally make it anything you want. You know, that's the good thing about it. You can customize the Pokemon to however you want it. You can also, you know, pick IVs. As you can see, you have like uh, minus attack stuff like that. Um, and you can pick the nature. So these are where you're gonna find that type of stuff. So after you pick all that, I'm just gonna go with the guest spread, give it the best of what it can have. It's just the easiest thing to do. You're gonna wanna go to import slash export. So once you have your set, this is your showdown set, and this is what you are going to be, uh, this is what you're gonna have to use 
Um, and there's like another trick, guys. What you can do is you can edit this before you say, uh, you know, copy it. If you want this the Pokemon to be shiny, you can do shiny. If it if you don't want it to be shiny, just leave out this whole line, right? But if you want it to be shiny, make sure you type, you know, make sure you leave that in there, you know, colon space, and then you can either make it a square shiny by adding square, or if you just want it to be a star, you just leave yes. Another thing you can do, you know, it's you know the way my bots are set up is they all all the pokemon you generate will have x shiny ninja as the original trainer name but if you want to switch that you can add the line ot colon and you can just add you know your ign you know so obviously you know you know it's already it comes with my ign but if you want to add that line you can you can also add uh you know if you want to change the ball it's in, you can add that line as well, like ball and then the semicolon space and say you want it in a love ball, boom, just like that. You just add the lines, guys, that's all you do. And then, you know, that's pretty much the basics. Control C, if you're on a uh, you know mobile device, you just hit uh, copy. So once we have it Control C copied, what we're gonna wanna do, guys, is go over to my Discord. So here's the Discord, guys. Uh, you know we have 3,100 members in there you know awesome community man wouldn't trade it for anything so uh, this is what we're going to do people are always active always hosting raids stuff like that we're gonna go to uh, one of the bots this one doesn't have anything in it like this so we have free syspot 3 which is Articuno we got Arceus and syspot 2 and then we got ninja bot and free syspot 1 so we're gonna do before you guys post your set you hit dollar sign trade and then you hit control V if you're on a computer or just copy if you're on your phone so there is our set it will whisper me an eight digit code so I have also have my account on my phone so this is how I'm gonna get to it easier uh, so you just send it and boom once you send it added to the link trade queue current position one uh, receiving Tyranitar so that is our T-Tar that we have built so what we're going to do now guys is go over the pokemon uh sword and shield so let's minimize all this stuff out just give me one second to do this we're going to go over to pokemon sword and shield as you can see i already have it up and ready so we're going to put in that code it sent me guys so the code is 1403 8336 check your whispers guys or your uh, your messages and you will see the whisper or it's whisper because I'm so used to twitch but you know your uh, you know your DMS on discord so we're gonna wait for that and we're gonna see uh, if that if the T-Tar was right you know obviously I made the OT your IGN and you just trade it whatever you want guys I have it set to uh, you know I have it set to it will send back a PK8 of the Pokemon you sent so that means that you'll get you know this you know all the stats and setup for your cup foo or whatever you send the bot so there we go let's see if everything was correct ninja set over ninja that's funny all right so let's check this t-tar and let's see if it's all good to go It's holding our master ball, you can see. Okay, let's go to Pokemon. So, I named it Ninja. I put it in a love ball. As you can see, it's in a love ball. Uh, you know, it's holding the master ball. It's, it has all the moves I put on. Body press, body slam, earthquake, and protect. Let's check... Uh, Let's check the IGN. So I, I said your IGN. So that's what the IGN. So just like that, guys, your IGN. So all you have to do, guys, is add the lines. Unfortunately, those two lines, like OT and um, the ball, do not work, I'm pretty sure, in Twitch chat. So all of this is mainly set up for our Discord. So with that being said, what we're else we're going to try is we're also going to try to make an egg without... Uh, you know without pk8 so without our you know without pk hex 
PK8 file. So let's do that, guys. So we can go to Showdown for that. So we're going to make another set. Go to New Team, Add Pokemon. So it has to be something you can legally find in an egg. So, example, Charmander. So you guys can get a Charmander legally from an egg. Eggs cannot hold items, so make sure to not put an item on it. It also has to be level 1, guys. You know everything that hatches legally out of an egg is level 1. doesn't matter. You can make a shiny level 1, male, female. It's up to you. But the way you get the trick to this is you have to name it Egg. Give it the nickname Egg. All right? And make sure that the moves are uh, Egg moves, right? So if I go... So in some of my announcements, guys, if you want to check that, I have some, you know... So Tackle ember stuff like that make sure the moves on it are correct so i know i have another one ability soul power make sure the moves you give it are all correct guys so what we're going to do is give it belly drum ancient power uh counter and bite so let's do that so belly drum ancient power ancient power it does, you actually don't even have to have all four moves. And make sure it doesn't have EVs on it as well. So what we're going to do with that now is let's make it a hidden ability as well. You're going to do import slash export, the same as we always do, guys. And then hit control C or copy, right? And then what you're going to want to do is go back to the Discord and go back to the SysBot, free SysBot. Like I said, guys, dollar sign trade, control V. There is our Charmander, Solar Power Level 1, Shiny Yes. We nicknamed it Egg, so it should be an Egg. It's a male, IV, Zero Tag, Belly Drum, Ancient Power. So, boom, just like that, guys. Added to the Link Trade queue, Current Position 1, Receiving Mysterious Egg. Woo. All right, so now what we're going to do, guys, is go back to Sword and Shield. Like I said, I have my phone here, so I know uh, the link code. So our code is, for this time, is going to be... 8408 5, 5, All right, so let's search for that. Let's see if the egg is correct. And obviously, guys, if you didn't know, everything uh, you know that's in an egg that you hatch will have your OT. So don't worry about adding line OT or anything like that. So let's resend back to TTAR. I really don't need it. It was just for an example, guys just for an example so there's the Egbert that's what we call him in the stream guys there's the Egbert so let's see if it was correct see you later a lot of ninja send a ninja to ninja goodbye ninja yep so we're going to see if this is our level 1 Charmander. Obviously guys, eggs can't hold, you know, items. They can't have EV sets. They can't, you know, be past level 1. You guys know that. They can't have any move. So make sure you keep that in mind as well, guys. So see you later, bot. So let's hatch this egg. Just to make sure it's right. It is in a Pokeball. I forgot to change the ball. Guys, you can do that, by the way. If you add the line ball, you can change that to any ball you want. As long as Charmander can be in that. Alright, so let's see it, guys. There he is. There's our shiny Charmander. Just like that, we made it. I forgot to make a square shiny too. You can do that. I showed you guys how to do that. You just add the line shiny square instead of yes, and you change the ball by adding the line ball. Just like that. So let's check out our uh, stats on it. So there's our level one Charmander. Check summary. We did make a zero attack. I do remember that. Ninja, obviously. Solar power. You know, it gave it scratch and growl, but we gave it belly drum and ancient power. You know, all that good stuff, guys. So it is all correct. There it is. 
you know and guys there's I'm gonna be making other videos on uh, you know how to's and stuff like that I want to make a video on how you can get an easy shiny den but this was just a video I wanted to cover really quickly on how you make the set you know uh, you gotta make sure to join the discord guys uh, all that good stuff you have to be in the discord first then you show down you can make eggs you can check your seeds but I'll be making uh, you know more videos to come this was just a quick little video I wanted to make you know just so I have something to give people a reference to but you know that being said guys I really appreciate you know everyone coming together uh, in the community and really showing love you know we hope to bring new people in we try to do the best and the most for the ninja fam uh, but you know with that being said uh, you know we'll see you in the stream guys make sure to hit the like subscribe you know come over to twitch we are gonna start doing more on YouTube and stuff but uh, you know that's gonna be it for today's video and thank you so much, guys. Much love. Ninja out.